I was asked by a teacher when I was at career day the other day, uh, the teacher said, um, he said, he told me to give the top three business ideas to the students. Um, these were like home run businesses. What would be my top three businesses that I would give out to the kids to start, you know, j just, and they couldn't lose. And I had to look at them like, man, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. One thing about it, I, I don't believe, and I, and I know the brother didn't mean in the home, and I know he meant well, but the thing I, I want him to understand, like when you go to entrepreneurship, it's not a game. It's not a game whatsoever. And what I try to push with the young people and anybody, know yourself. Because this is one thing about doing a business. Um, when you, if you want to just do something extra, you want to have a, a, a hustle, you want to go ahead and cut grass, you want to sell cakes, you want to um, sell your artwork and stuff like that, that's cool. Do it. We start talking about the thing of business because you know I'm here in Atlanta and everybody and their mama want to start a business up. So, um, I want I really push the, the to to people to understand know how you are because it's one thing to sit here and spend money on different equipment, different uh, supplies, make certain investments, maybe you know in, in 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 leases and things like that, pay for it with the hope that you're able to sell certain products and services. You got to be kind of built different to make sure you can do those particular things. Like I said, now I want to get, you know, you're doing a, something on the side to get you some money. I want to get that confused with doing the business. When we start talking about going down the road of entrepreneurship, what I really try to push to people is know how you are. Are you okay with delayed gratification? Are you okay with uh, making, you know, certain sacrifices now before things happen later? Are you okay with doing putting certain efforts and money and time in and it may not bring nothing about, you know, you may bring experience, may bring education, things like that, but you may not necessarily get any income or revenue from that. Right. So you got to kind of be wired a certain way and no, everyone doesn't start out that way, but I do think people need to start thinking about what kind of person they are because everybody's not going to be patient. Everybody's not going to be disciplined. And I really push to, to kids like, Hey, go out and dibble and dabble anybody. Dibble and dabble out there and just, you know, if you like doing this, you like mowing lawns, you like selling certain things, cool. But we want to start going to another level with it. You got to kind of look at what kind of person you are. And that's why I didn't really want to push the kids to, hey, do this business, do that business. Um, because, again, it's not it, it's not a game. And I really want people to understand it because it's far too often you got people lose them to everything they have because they have a passion or idea for something they want to try. But because they have experience, they've worked in a certain industry, but they don't know anything really about business they don't have that fear it doesn't hit them to the last minute like i might not get my money back people are not buying from me people are not uh pushing me or, or reaching out to me to pick up my product and service i'm posting all over social media but nobody's reaching out that stuff will drive you crazy if you ain't built for it you're not kind of prepared for it and so that's why i really wanted the kids to kind of get a grasp of you know go out and get you some feelers see if it's you know something you like or whatever you like doing and then from that point, and it's just for people too, mainly adults, kind of assess how you are. Can you handle those particular things? Just something to think on. Uh, but it was a real cool career day. Um, but but that was a, a question a, a teacher asked me, and I was like, nah, I wouldn't necessarily want to, you know, look at it more so like it's the game. Just do these quick, easy things. Learn how you are. You know what kind of person you are and how you built. More great information just like that. Go to Mr. Short Doll on YouTube.